today we're going to take a look at the Intellivision Plug and Play 2nd Edition. Now I had the first edition of this, had a nice selection of games on it. Didn't really keep it very long. The only reason why I picked this up because it does have a game on here that I'm absolutely bonkers over. And that's Tron Deadly Discs. I love that game on the regular television console. And now I can have it in a little plug and play form. So let's take a closer look at this console. Well, here's a close-up of the box, and it shows the different games that are included on the console. Up on the back here, you can see we have Astro Smash 2, Beach Volleyball, Frog Bog, Crown of Kings, Long Drive Golf, Space Gunner, Deadly Discs, oh yeah, Maze Shoot, Tennis, and Space Armada 2. So let's open this box up and take a look at the handheld unit itself. So the handheld is pretty straightforward. Standard D-pad interface. We got our select and start buttons. We have a reset button up here to go back to the main menu. Then we have our action buttons, A and B. Then we have an X and a Y. Plus we have shoulder buttons. It does run on four AA batteries, which are held by this screw inside of this compartment right here. I hate these screwed together uh, compartments. I like the ones with little snap tabs. And it is a composite video output. So one channel sound, video out. The manual is fairly nice. Talks about, you know, the different games included on it. How to install the batteries. How to play the different games, like May Shoot, Space Armada 2. Really nice manual. What's really neat, when I picked this up, I found somebody has recorded their high scores in some of the games. Like Space Armada 2. Looks like uh, their highest score was 14,910 on that one. Astro Smash 2, 1490, and May Shoot 23. I love finding things like this when I buy uh, games and everything at flea markets and thrift stores. It's, it's kind of neat to find this kind of stuff inside. So let's install some batteries in this little bad boy, and we'll go through the 10 different games. So let's turn this baby on. Oh, I like the running man, that was pretty cool. Signosaurus 2005. So here's the game select menu. Looks really nice. So here's Astro Smash, Beach Volleyball, Crown of Kings, Deadly Discs. Frog Bog. That's a fun game. Long Drive Golf. Maze Shoot. Space Armada. Space Gunner. Tennis. Back to Astro Smash. So I'm going to start with Astro Smash first. So I'm going to start that game. Press Start button to continue. And I died. <laughs> B button warps. That's cool. Woo! Hit the Y button, you warp all over the place. I love this game on the Intellivision. It's one of my favorite games on the Intellivision system. Oh, here's something new. Oh, I like the power-ups. That is awesome. It's a nice little addition to uh, Astro Smash. Having power-ups you can collect. Oh, there's another one. Oh, get it. Got it. Oh, man, I saw a little Space Invader guy. Now that was neat. I never know. I never owned it in television back when they came out. Uh, I had a buddy that had one. And this is one of the games we used to play for hours and hours. It's kind of, it's kind of a nice game. But, uh, they did a good job with this one. Oh, for you. Oh, well, that wasn't a bonus. <laughs> so let's try another game out. Hit the reset button. Get the running man back. So, we'll 
try beach volleyball. Level one. Yeah, I do level one. How about a good gamer? All right. Serve. Hit what? Oh. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Puts a little, uh, like that. Puts, ah. Oh. Puts a little circle where the balls will come down because that actually helps out. Okay, here we go. And. Ah, oh, I am terrible at hitting the friggin' thing. Oh, 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 here we go. Got it. Oh, and bam. Oh, come on. Oh, no. I hit the wrong button. Oh, what are the net? Okay, come on. Get this serve right. You can do it. Come on. There we go. And I hit the net. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Oh, under the net. <laughs> Bam! Over the net. Oh, oh. Oh, he hit it. Good. That would have been out of here. Pop up. It's a pop up. Another pop up. It's over the net. Well, I'm really glad they put those circles on the on the ground. There we go. Over to that. Oh, come on. Come on. I gotta get a point. Yes! I got a point. Yay! Whack. Yeah, another point. Well, on that note, let's try another game. Next up, Crowd of Kings. Game mode, Sightseer, Weak and Adventurer, Soldier of Fortune, or Hard. Let's, uh, let's do Weak and, oh, let's do Easy. Ooh. Oh, boy. Oh! Well, don't get shot by your own arrow. Whoa! Run, 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 run! Shoot him! Whack! Exploring the caverns. Bang! Whoa! Come on, shoot, shoot. Oh, I think I'm out of bullet. Oh, oh, oh man, I'm out of shots! No! I need more arrows. No, watch out for the snake, you dummy. Oh, 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 oh. Ah. I'm gonna leave the snake away. Oh, oh shoot. What? Oh. oh man, there's just critters everywhere. Fun uh, dungeon crawl game. Not bad. Try something else. Next up, oh, one of my favorites, Deadly Discs. Yeah. We'll do normal speed. Ooh. Like the little intro music there. Oh. Now this plays more like the Atari 2600 version. On the uh, television, you can use the number pad to throw the disc at different angles while you're running a different direction. 
especially when you use two controllers. But, you know, if you like the 2600 version of uh, Tron Deadly Disc, then you're going to like this one as well. It has, you know, improved graphics, much better than the 2600 version. I don't know what it is about this game, but what I like it, why I like it so much. It's just, I always have. I first played this game on the Intellivision at a uh, demo kiosk at a service merchandise. We do fast speed. And ever since then, I've been hooked on it. As soon as it was available for the Atari 2600, I, uh, I got my parents to buy it for me right away, and I proceeded to play the game hours on end for months. Got really good at it, too, on the, on the uh, Atari 2600. Oh, man. Died. So let's try another game. Next we have Frog Bug. Let's catch some flies. Oh, I missed. Ah. Ah. Oh, I am terrible at this. I haven't got one bug yet. There we go, finally. Oop. I like the little croaking noises. The oh, computer's just decimating me. Get the bug! Ah, oh, I missed. Oop, got him. Come here, fly. Fifty points so far. Computer's uh, stomping me. That's a cool game. Let's try another one. Next up, Long Drive Golf. Golf games are okay. Ready, player one. Whack. Hey, 326 yards. Awesome. Okay, here we go. Oh, I hit clear off to the side. Rats. yard come on oh oh I think I won this one yes oh I really messed up out of bounds Just get that timing. Oh! <laughs> Oops. I think that was a good one. Yeah, that was a good one. Oh, here we go. That was an excellent hit. That's how far it went. Oh, shoot. They hit the button the second time. Rats. Come on, come on. Darn. 
missed it again. At least it stayed in bounds. Come on, come on, come on. <laughs> Way out of bounds. And the computer wins, naturally. May shoot. This should be interesting. Oops. Got him. Now, I kind of like how you have to set ricochets <laughs> to hit things. That's kind of neat. a pretty cool game. Bloop, 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 bloop. 19 seconds. Hey, I got 30 points! Yay! Hey, I beat the highest score this guy had. He had 23. Cool. Okay, next up. Space Armada. Regular game. Boop. Space Invaders. This is actually a pretty nice version of Space Invaders. Ooh, hold down the X button, you have rapid fire. Get the flying saucer, yes. Oh, base restored, yay. Die, you freaking invaders, die. Oh, crunch. I'm not supposed to do that. What? Oh, power up. Ooh, shields. Awesome. <laughs> come on, come on. Yes! Now I like the power-ups on this. This is pretty cool. I'm enjoying this game. What the? What was that all about? I think I froze me. Crunch. Power up. Give me a power up. What's this one? What's this one do? Ooh, dual shots. Yeah. Aw. You can use them very long. Dang. It's like it's raining shots. Oh. 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 <laughs> 1990. Okay, next up, Space Gunner. <laughs> this kind of reminds me of the game they used to use on this TV show called, uh, oh, what was that? Oh, I forgot what the name of it was. They would yell fire over the telephone. And the little thing would shoot. This one's, uh, uh it's kind of okay. It's, uh, huh. I'm not really impressed with this one on this little handheld. Would have been if they would have put the level out of that one game, uh, oh, what's it called? Looks like the Cylon warrior ships are flying around the screen when you shoot them. They explode in three different directions. I think it's called Space Attack, if I'm 
remember right. Yeah, this is kind of bleh. So much for that one. Next and last, we have tennis or fancy pong. All right, here we go. Lay it on me. Whack. You're supposed to hit the ball, dummy. And whack. Oh. I like the sound effect. Holy cow, I'm terrible at this game. the ball back. Hit the ball back. Come on. You're supposed to swing at it, you dummy. Oh! That a fault. Oh, no, no, no. Go. Oh! There we go. Come on. Oh, jeez. <laughs> oh, I did terrible at this one. Let's switch sides. Will he do any better? Probably not. Guess it wasn't just me that couldn't serve the ball. Wow. That was terrible. Huh. Okay, here we go. Hit the wrong freaking button again. Over the net. Oh, come on. Okay, <laughs> I'm obviously very bad at this game. Well, this is actually a really nice little plug-and-play unit. I really enjoy this thing. Thanks for watching. Thanks for watching.